Happy New Year. Welcome to 2020. So, this is 12 months of floral fusion. Each month, we're going to be fusing the art of floral design with other elements in the design industry. The first month, we are going to be taking inspiration from the 2020 Pantone color of the year, which is classic blue. In the first part of this 12 part series, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a hand wrapped bouquet that you can simply plop in a vase. You guys ready? Let's do it. We have Israeli Ruscus, Thistle, Hydrangea, Delphinium, Amaranthus, and beautiful Ranunculus. Start first with foliage and then we're going to add in our hydrangea. And then the thistle. The thistle is going to help support the hydrangea in the bouquet. And we're just going to adjust as we go, creating a very nice round shape. And again, just kind of holding the hydrangea together with the thistle. And then we're going to start adding in some of this nice deep blue belladonna delphinium. And we can kind of poke it through the middle of the bouquet if we need to. It's kind of a little something I like to do. And then we're just going to keep adding on keeping that foundation, but notice how I'm kind of rotating it so that it's a nice round shape. And I've used up almost all of my foliage now. These are beautiful ranunculas. They have a really nice color to them. They're going to pop. So I'm probably going to um, wait until the end to put those in because that's going to be a nice contrast. Again, I'm just kind of poking through the center to get all of the flowers in and then just evenly dispersing and rotating the bouquet as I go. And my thistle, I'm going to keep on the edge here. So see how I've kind of created this nice round bouquet. Now, Last but not least, we're going to do our ranunculus. I'm going to put them right here. We're going to poke them through. This is going to be our nice, beautiful, deep magenta tone. Even though this bouquet is mostly blues, we're also going to add in a nice contrast to pop. And then I'm just evenly dispersing this around the bouquet and actually poking it through at an angle so that it has that nice round shape. I can cut the stems and then it can plop very easily into the vase. I'm almost done. And it looks like it needs another one right here in the center. So I'm going to pull that through. And now we're ready for our filler. Here's our amaranthus. This would be nice with some pops of amaranthus. Okay. Notice I'm holding the bouquet kind of at the base. And I can cut it after. So for the amaranthus, again, I'm going to pull it through. And I'm not going to hold the bouquet too tight. If I hold it too tight, I'm not going to be able to pull these through at all. And then evenly just kind of making sure that all the spaces are filled. And we're all 
almost done, you guys. It's coming along pretty nice. And then again, I can keep rotating it. All right, that was everything. We're ready to cut the stems now. So I'm gonna take a regular set of clippers and I'm gonna go through and cut all the stems. Cut them all the same length because you're gonna plop them into a vase and you're gonna want them to be uniform. And notice how there's a little bit of a spiral to the bottom, okay? Here's a little trick. I'm gonna take a rubber band, any kind of rubber bands would work. I'm gonna poke it through the stems, just like this. I'm gonna tie it around and pull it back through inside so that it kind of just stays together temporarily before I put it in my vase, okay? Now I'm ready to put my flowers in my vase. I have a nice blue vase to go and coordinate with the 2020 Pantone color of the year. And I'm going to just simply plop my bouquet inside of the vase. This is very easy gift to give to someone and they might have a vase at home. They can easily just put this nice bouquet in right in the vase and not have to worry about arranging it. You've already done a spiral for them. You've already done the rubber band trick. So here we go. Just gonna fit right into the vase. And now it's a beautiful flower arrangement for somebody to enjoy. Fun fact number one, the oldest evidence of formal floral arranging and arranging of bouquets can be traced back all the way to ancient Egypt to 2500 BCE. Pretty cool and I'm totally into history. Thanks for watching. I hope this has inspired you to make your own creations at home and we'll see you in February.